State House of Representatives District 175 seat, uh, J.C. Cunningham and Amy Carter are the candidates. J.C. Cunningham is here tonight, and uh, we will welcome him to the stage. Again, some of these districts have been redrawn, including District 175, which now, and J.C., I'm going to let you correct me if I've got it wrong, it includes part of Lowndes County, uh, all of Brooks County, I believe, and part of, and a good portion of Thomas County as well in the new redrawn district, which will go into effect uh, on January the 1st. So, You're uh, absolutely right. JC, thank you for being here. Uh, you have three minutes for your opening statement. I was hoping I had someone um, beside me, uh, but uh, first of all, I just want to thank you, Chris, and thank the Home Builders Association uh, and 105.9 uh, for putting on this forum. But most of all, I'd just like to uh, thank all the citizens for coming out. You know, one of the reasons I decided to run was uh, because Back in the summer of 2011, we found out that there was a group of people that wanted to uh, consolidate uh, the Valdosta and Lowndes school system. And uh, I didn't think it was right. A lot of us didn't think it was right. And so I made a couple of phone calls and uh, a lot of us uh, that were part of the, the Friends of Valdosta City Schools, we made calls to our, our legislators in Atlanta and asked them to intervene and to uh, help us ensure that every voice in Lowndes County had an opportunity to speak during that process. And uh, we didn't get any answers back from our legislature. As a matter of fact, uh, uh, my opponent, Amy Carter, who was the governor's floor leader, uh, told us that the governor was too busy and, and, and could not help quell the situation that could potentially for this community apart. I think it's very important that anyone that represents a body of people not get too big for their bridges. I think it's very important anyone who thinks they're gonna represent a body of people realize that they are there to serve those people. My father always told me that the definition of a leader was to first be able to serve you know, our greatest leader in the history yeah. of man said he came to serve, not to be served. But I think our representatives have forgotten that they have to serve people of South Georgia. I think that we need legislation, legislators throughout South Georgia that will definitely articulate the values of South Georgia. Now, people always say that, and that's so easy to be said, but how, how do we do that? We do that by talking to the people that we represent. Just because you elect me as your next state representative doesn't mean I only represent the Democratic Party. When you, when you what does that mean? 30 seconds. When you, when you, excuse me, you didn't give us those rules. When, when, in closing, uh, I, I, I want to represent Lowndes, uh, Lowndes, Brooks, and Thomas because we need to ensure that we take South Georgia to Atlanta, not Atlanta to South Georgia. 